Everybody, welcome to Lifestyle Live. Happy Thursday. And I know what? I'm, I'm, I'm very happy right now because I'm here with Just Love Coffee. Not because there's coffee, but because there's something called a womlet. A womlet. Erica, <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, I think this uh, requires some investigating, guys. So uh, I'm going to get into this. And uh, hopefully there'll be some left by the time Amber gets over here. Yeah. <laughs> a womlet. I like that little waffle, a little omelet. Just mix the two together. And the I team is on it. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Hey, Good Ross. morning, everybody. Good Ooh. morning. Uh, do you want to say the date and all that stuff? I don't know. What is the date? Today is April 7th, <laughs> 2022, and it is a 2022. Thursday. 2022. It's a yeah. Thursday. One more day. We're almost there. Yes, almost to the weekend. And we're going to take you down below City Market Ooh. this morning down into the stillness and the shadows where we will breathe dank air in 20,000 square feet of passageways known as the catacombs. I know, it's so cool down there. So cool. Hey, plus, you could win nearly $2,000 in gift cards and help your teen find the perfect job and college scholarship. I call that a win-win. It is the first ever Indianapolis High School Fair this Saturday. And hey, you are invited. Oh, and the fourth wall is here. This unique group combines music, oh, theater, fun. dance, and apparently hoverboards. Oh. They do circus stuff at their shows. And they are playing the District Theater this Friday and Saturday. They first, though, will be performing, be performing here on Life Style Live. How do you think we would do on hoverboards? I've never been on one of those before. Well, Have you? I'm, I'm not a hoverboard. I, I, I am an old school skateboarder, though. Um, oh. I, I did a lot of... I'm, I was that first generation of urethane wheels yeah. and sealed bearings. You know what I so. love? Rollerblading. I have some rollerblades at my house. I used to do it all the time when I was a kid. Back in the day, my family, we would always take off. We would go rollerblading through all the parks and everything. I loved it. My son loves that. It's I mean. it's not easy, per se. Yeah. It's When I got back on them after a while, I was like, oh, I don't remember doing this. I think it's different when you're a kid. Maybe it's but time I like for me it. to try skateboarding again. Huh? I, I, I should try skateboarding. All right. Today's question of the day is brought to you by Kitchen Saver Custom Cabinet Renewal. Yes. That question, where is the top place you take out-of-town guests? when they visit our fair city. Mm, well, you're just kind of getting acclimated, George. Yes. Have you, if you have oh, someone come visit, do you oh, have a, a place you go? I, I take them to Just Love Coffee. Um, <laughs> okay, all right. That was a fantastic okay. answer. Yeah, I'm, I'm just sucking up. I just like that. Eric is here. <laughs> well, hey, Judy says The Circle, Brown County, and Long's Bakery, and The 500. Lots to see and do in Indy if you are adventurous. I agree. There is so much good yeah. stuff here. Well... Sharon says, the 500 and Rick's Boatyard. Ooh, Rick's. So, Sharon, I've been to Rick's quite a few times. That's actually close to my house, close to Brownsburg. An amazing place with an amazing view as well. Vicky says, Gray Brothers Cafeteria. Vicky, that's my number two. I love Gray's. That's a good mm -hmm. one, too, George. Well, I'll take them to Just Judy's, too. Um, <laughs> Speaking of Judy's. Frosty Boy in New Pal. Oh. Can't miss it. Okay, okay. Frosty Boy. I need, I need to know more about that. Yeah. Frosty Boy. Well, Do you think that's ice cream? Probably. What do you think that is? Or maybe ice maybe cream? frozen okay. custard. They're giving me a thumbs yeah, up. So. My guys are right. giving me a thumbs up. They're shaking right. their heads. Okay. Ice cream. I um, could go with ice cream. By the way, uh, when we read the question of the day, if there's a little bit of a delay, it's because we have these little tiny monitors on the cameras. <laughs> so Randy and I have to get up here and just, you know, look, and then we can read it. So they take us off camera. So just see. Just give you a little behind-the-scenes <laughs> info there. So, yeah, yeah, I like the behind-the-scenes stuff, right? I, I guess I'm okay with it, but, you know, well, I'll help you out. That's, that's what I do. I'll help you out.